Hi, I'm Chris Anderson, and today's topic is The Knight in Shining Armor. Now, you could read more about this chapter in my book, Kissing Frogs, Tall Tales and Insights from the Dating Pond. Now, you think you've met Prince Charming, but keep in mind, The Knight in Shining Armor has a lot of steel around him with that armor wear. So let's ask a few questions because over time, Father Time will tell you all on whether this guy should sink or swim. Number one, and I won't even number them. Is he honest with you? Does he make you a priority? When he leaves you after a date, do you feel uplifted or do you feel deflated? Is he financially secure with himself? Does he enjoy the job that he's doing? Does it give him fulfillment? Does he have extracurricular activities? And has he really introduced you to his friends? If he spends most of his time texting or late meetings at the office or other meetings late at night, and he keeps pushing you aside, I would say those would be red flags. If he has children and he's not even there for his children, I would look at that closely. I would also look closely if his mother is very integral in his life, AKA saving his tail feathers all the time because he can't run a solid life. My wish for you princesses is that knight in shining armor is balanced enough to know what he's got. And at the end of the day, if he's not, you throw him back in the pond because the truth is you are the value. You bring the value to the plate and hopefully you meet a prince, and char and prince charming in the knight in shining armor that will let go of the armor and be real and treat you the way you deserve to be treated. So enjoy the book. You can catch us at thedatingpond.com or send me any stories. I'm always interested in hearing more. Make it a great day.